Okay, what I like to introduce you to today is the a new program that the university has introduced and um, we're taking students into this program in 2010. And this is a Bachelor of Science, Environment and Sustainability. It combines teaching in the field of ecology and in the field of climatology and focus on using our interest and understanding of the environment and the, the processes that operate in the environment to work towards sustainable use of our natural environment. What does it lead to? If you have an interest in green professions, if you have an interest in how humans interact with the natural environment, or in, if you have an interest to either study full-time here on campus or off-campus or part-time, then this program will cater for you and it will deliver a professional degree in the science. It's a professional science qualification. Um, you will examine or the program will examine and through your studies you will examine aspects of climate change, biodiversity, conservation, natural resource management and sustainability. And you're going to contribute to a new field of um, human endeavor of using what we have done in the past in a rather unsustainable way you will contribute to using our natural environment in a sustainable way and through your profession you will be able to uh, apply your knowledge of sustainability and achieve sustainability in professions be it engineering be it science be it in education if you're a teacher or if you teach at university level or are a researcher. So there's many professions you can work within. Um, the program, the Bachelor of Science, Environment Sustainability will basically provide you with the knowledge and the skills that you gain employment in industry, local, regional, state and national public service agencies. There are many professions you can work in. You can work as a climatologist, you can work in climate policy analysis environments, you can work in ecotourism, you can contribute to conservation and biodiversity management, you can work as an environmental consultant, you miss further studies, you can work as a science journalist or as a science teacher and even with uh, further postgraduate studies at university level you can become a trained um, qualified scientist and work in research organizations in Australia and abroad. So many uh, professions are open for you studying the Bachelor of Environment and Sustainability. When you have completed the program, what have you gained? You will be, and what will you be able to demonstrate? You will be able to demonstrate a detailed knowledge of major environmental issues, the human impact on the natural environment. You will also learn how the physical environment works and drives the composition of our natural environment. You will be able to apply knowledge of environmental issues and how human impact on the environment and how humans can work to sustainable environmental resource management. You will be able through this degree apply your skills and demonstrate more than just the basic competencies in many areas such as climatology physics, statistics and mathematics. If you have an interest in environmental sciences, ecology, conservation, natural resource management and sustainability, you will be able to uh, demonstrate that you understand what is happening in these fields and you will be able to apply your knowledge gained through studying in the Bachelor of Environment Sustainability. You will be able to apply this knowledge to manage um, your professional environment towards sustainability. Um, you will demonstrate a sound comprehension of social, political and environmental implications of the human impact on the global environment. And you will also be able to apply principles of sustainability, as I said before, in many professional um, fields. Now let's have a little bit at the um, structure of the program. It's basically composed of three um, three components. We have something which we refer to as foundation studies um, or courses. We have the core courses of the environment sustainability major. These are eight courses. And then you have a 
the option to select a second major from anywhere across the university, from any of the other faculties, and you will have the option to um, elect courses of your interest that contribute to the um, whole package of the Bachelor of Science and Environment. So there's eight courses in this major of Environment and Sustainability. They are courses that introduce you to natural resource management and to the area of sustainability and to the subject of climatology. Let's have a look just at two examples of um, the courses we're covering here. One of the first year subjects in the first semester that's taken by students in this program as well as by students across campus. Um, this is a course in um, titled Environmental Studies. What you will do in this course is that you will study environmental issues of a global scale. The course content is interdisciplinary. You will cover biophysical environments, you will cover political issues, you will cover economy, society, and you will cover how human impacts on the natural environment. In this course, you will examine from a global perspective and uh, on the regional scale how land is utilized, what the impact is on humans, on mining and fishing, um, how we produce energy in the environment, how we use water, how all our human activity leads to pollution of the atmosphere, how urban systems operate and how we deal with waste management and with the industrialization and how we can use our understanding of this topic and apply it in a way that we achieve sustainable use of the environment. So that's one example. This is a first year, first semester subject, environmental studies. If we then go, for example, into the second year, um, I selected here an example for you. This is a course on climate change and variability. It's probably the most pressing issue humanity is facing currently. We have to understand how we impact on climate. Climate is changing, there's no doubt about it, and climate is also variable. There's natural variability in the climate system. And climate drives where we live, how we build our cities, how we build our houses. Climate drives how much heating is required during winter, how much cooling is re required during summer. So we need to know how climate operates, how it operates in the past, present and future. So this course will introduce you as a student within this program to the processes and mechanisms that drive basically our natural world and our climate system. We will introduce you to climate models. You have read in the papers that climate is changing. We know that climate in 100 years or 200 years from now on will be warmer by two or three degrees. How do we know this? Well, we use climate models. So in this course, you will learn about climate models in a very descriptive way. We want to communicate to you an understanding that you can assess the performance of these climate models without necessarily understanding the full mathematical and physical details of these models. But you will learn how to assess the output from these models and how you assess future climate scenarios. We will introduce you to climate change, climate variability, to past climates of the planet on all scales, from global to regional and local scales. And we also introduce you to historical approaches, how we are already dealing with climate change. Sea level is rising, storms are more frequent, they're impacting on our coast environments, they impact on the areas such as the Gold Coast, on areas such as Harvey Bay, and uh, we know that our climate is drying, so how is the system operating and leads to this change. So that's a second year course in this major. So in summary, um, the Bachelor of Science Environment Sustainability offers a rewarding career in industry and public enterprises. Um, it offers the opportunity to contribute to the sustainability agenda in many professional fields and um, the program is appealing, its courses and the major in itself is appealing to a broad range of students.